Philosophy is a study of reality. Philosophy allows you to see the big picture. Philosophy asks the most basic questions. Where does everything come from? Where is everything going? What is man's nature? What is human happiness? And it provides concrete answers to these questions that are the questions that every human being has to wrestle with. Every human being has to answer. We try to show how perennial ideas affect the world in which we live now. It asks those questions and provides answers that, that transform your life. You're able to see how everything you do, how it relates to your ultimate end, and how that end should dictate everything you do. Every choice you make should be made with the idea of what is going to fulfill me. We have students. They're able to see the capacity of the human intellect to know truth, to discern what the good life is, and to see how what reason affirms about reality, about God, about man, is entirely compatible and supports the faith that they grew up in. And then it allows them to instorium in Christo, you know, to, to, to renew all things in Christ, a culture that has rejected Christ. And philosophy allows us to do that, and it allows us to, on rational grounds, engage the culture to show how truth can be known, okay, you can show what, what the good life is, what it's not, and then open people's minds. What sets Christendom apart, and what's foundational to all the professors, is we largely embrace the doctrine and the method of St. Thomas Aquinas. When we approach ethics, when we approach metaphysics, when we approach the philosophy of human nature, we give a kind of pride of place to a Thomistic worldview. We have our most seasoned educators who've been educating and, and have been found to be profoundly successful in the classroom for decades, and they are teaching all of the core classes. And then obviously they're teaching you know, to their research interests in the electives that the students take. So they get to know these professors, they get to have lunch with these professors, they often worship with these professors. The professors are always very available uh, to students in their offices. And so they experience mentorship. Philosophy majors at Christum College have gone on to do everything under the heavens. Tech industry, law, advanced degrees in philosophy, business. I have a friend of mine who's at head of an MBA program said the optimal major for business is philosophy. What serves a great professional in, in business is to have that broad education and then get the specialization in graduate school. With a philosophy student, they're able to see the big picture. And once you see the big picture, you can then specialize in almost anything. Once you learn how to think, those intellectual habits of mind prepare you to do anything. For man, in his mind, one wing is faith. Okay, the other wing is reason. And we need both of them in order to ascend to the heights of truth. And that's something our students don't have coming in, and something that philosophy provides to them during their time at Christian College.